From the campus of Campbell Hall in North Hollywood, I'm Courtney Jones, and this is the High School Spotlight. In recent years, the Boys Hoops program here has had more than its fair share of success, developing a bit of a reputation as a hardwood powerhouse. Well, in just a second, we're going to catch up with one Viking basketball superstar who just added a brand new sport to his repertoire. But first, the CIF Southern section has released their preseason girls volleyball poll for Division 1-2A. Let's see who made the cut. Opening up at the top is Santa Margarita, the defending sectional champ. The Eagles lost eight seniors off that title team, but they do return Kylie Hargraves. The 2008 Division I Player of the Year, she committed to Wake Forest this past summer and is one of the top-rated outside hitters in the nation. And speaking of big-time talents, Miracosa and their big gun, USC-bound Fallon Fanoi Moana, come in at number two. Number four, Los Al might be the deepest team in the region. Legendary head coach Dan Glenn's Newport Harbor squad opens up at number seven. And representing the IE, Murata Valley comes in at the 10 spot. It's sure to be a thrilling season on the volleyball court in the southern section. And over here at Campbell Hall, there's already a ton of excitement surrounding the football team. One big reason is the play of a brand new face on offense, who just so happens to double as one of the area's most highly regarded hoops performers. On the basketball court, Campbell Hall's Austin McBroom has always looked at home. His coming out party came as just a freshman when he poured in 30 points in the 2008 State Division IV title game, leading the Vikings to victory. Now in his junior year, he's firmly established as one of the region's top point guard prospects, possessing a unique combination of speed, balance, and vision. But in a surprise move, McBroom has decided to put those same attributes to use on the gridiron this fall as a running back and receiver in the Viking offense. Well, actually, I've always wanted to play football ever since I was a little kid. I enjoy running the ball. Um, I enjoy catching the ball. I enjoy just having a blast with the teammates on the, on the field and off the field. Just the whole love of the game. A phenomenal natural athlete who's also excelled at baseball on the prep level, the 5'11 McBroom has emerged as the ultimate big play threat on the football field. In his very first game, he exploded for 161 yards and one touchdown on the ground, spearheading a 40-12 Campbell Hall opening day victory over Antelope Valley. Well, it was one of my first football games, so I was more excited than being anxious, so I just couldn't wait to get out there on the field and do well. Um, we've been practicing for the whole summer, so it's just good to go out there and play somebody instead of our own teammates. With their newfound weapon on offense, the Vikings look to have a legitimate shot at the East Valley Division title. As for the long-term future of this once-in-a-blue-moon athletic talent, there's simply no telling. Sky's the limit. Uh, depends how hard he works and, and which sport ends up taking him which way. You know, it all depends on where he goes because he's, he's just as talented at basketball as, as well as baseball. So whatever, whatever the young man hearts desire, he, he'll end up doing. We'll definitely be keeping close tabs on McBroom throughout the fall and on into the winter when he hits the basketball court again too. Make sure you check in with us next time around as we take you out to the pool and bring you up to date on what's been going on in boys water polo. Thanks for joining us on the High School Spotlight.